Carmen Hernandez has always been an advocate for her community. But she says getting the city to make repairs in her building has been impossible. From floors to ceilings, things are falling apart. These are pictures and videos of conditions inside 1471 and 1473 Watson Avenue in the Bronx. PIX11 visited the residents Wednesday. Hi, Reverend, oh my God, good to see you. Reverend Carmen Hernandez is a youth community pastor and the tenant president fighting for repairs. She says enough is enough. It's not just fixing, it's the disrespect that they have for these tenants. Gigi Hampton says her four-year-old son has to bathe in this bathroom. This leak, she says, started over a year ago. Water is also coming out of the light fixture as well. I have a four-year-old son who goes to the bathroom by himself. God forbid if he touches the light fixture while water is coming out. That's a hazard. Jessica Barrio showed us this picture of her kitchen floor right now. That is your kitchen that's caved in. My kitchen floor, yes. So how, how do you cook? Where do you cook? I don't cook. 80-year-old Virginia Moret says she's afraid to invite her grandchildren over. She says her home is a health hazard. 15 years I had this leak. I was back and forth in court, back and forth in court. They did nothing. 1471 Watson Avenue has some of the worst living conditions I have ever seen. Representative Richie Torres from the Bronx reached out to PIX11 for help. We informed NYCHA about the conditions. You know, we sent a team of organizers to knock on doors, to inspect conditions, to take pictures. We sent those pictures to NYCHA. It's time for NYCHA to be an effective landlord. Torres says all of these problems are the symptoms of a much bigger issue of NYCHA not having enough funding and bad management. There's likely to be a second reconciliation bill centered around infrastructure. And we have to send the message that housing is infrastructure, public housing is infrastructure. And we have good news. NYCHA tells us they have visited these residents' apartments and scheduled repairs, plastering, painting, and will send carpenters. They say management is meeting with Reverend Hernandez to discuss these repairs. And you know we'll be back. And if you have a story, reach out to us at Monica Morales TV on Facebook, Instagram, or Twitter. We're making it happen in the Bronx. Monica Morales, Pixel 11 News.